Welcome back to Crypto Warehouse. My name is Mike and today we are going to take a look at Play Doge. We are going to go through this game, this pre-sale. We're going to go through what we think of the project and try and break down everything about this project that you need to know to make a decision. We're going to have a look at the roadmap, the tokenomics, the smart contract audit. We're going to have a look at their socials what's being said about Play Doge in the media, and then we're going to give you our conclusion and what price prediction we expect for Play Doge. Before we begin, however, can we please ask you to like and subscribe to Crypto Warehouse and help us grow the channel. So one of the hottest pre-sales right now is Play Doge, a digital dog pet that combines 90s nostalgia with modern day play to earn rewards. The project, which has just launched, has raised over $2.5 million in its first 10 days of pre-sale. And that's what's grabbed my attention about Play Doge. As you can see, we're up to $2.6 million raised for the project already. So what about this game appeals to me? Well, I happen to be of an older generation that remembers 8-bit technology, and I remember playing games like this in my early youth. It is a nostalgic 8-bit experience. but it's been integrated into the blockchain. Anybody can play this game, especially those that remember Tamagotchis. Tamagotchis were all the craze in the early 90s, as I'm sure many of you will remember. Play Doge describes itself then as a mobile-based play-to-earn game that transforms the iconic Doge meme into a Tamagotchi-style virtual pet. Embrace the 90s nostalgia, buy play tokens in pre-sale to enjoy classic 2D adventures and earn more crypto. So this is a play to earn game, blockchain integration, and of course taps into that 8 bit generation. And for those of you wondering, this game will be available on both the Apple phone and on the Google Play Store from the day of launch. Now the tokenomics for Play Doge are very good. 50% of the tokens are sold on pre-sale. 7.5% will go to community rewards. 12.5% for marketing, 11.5% for liquidity, and 6% for staking. So unlike a lot of gaming tokens that we've covered on this platform over the last few weeks, we don't have 30 or 40% going to the team and early investors. 50% of this token is being given to you guys. This makes a world of difference because what you don't want on day one are the VCs and teams dumping their tokens. And in this case, you have half the tokens. It's not likely to happen. Now let's have a look at the Space Invaders style roadmap. In phase one, contract audit, we're going to look at that in a minute. Pre-sale has already started, they've raised $2.6 million already. Social activation, we're going to have a look at their socials as well. And the initial marketing push, we're going to go through some of the articles in the media in a minute. Phase two, app development starts, pre-sale ends, the DEX token is launched and the product roadmap is released. Again. This is a pre-sale, you have to remember that this is not a live project. Phase three, increased marketing, continued app testing, mini game beta, and first centralized exchange listings. In phase four, Play Doge app is released, full mini games are launched, the community airdrop and bigger centralized exchange listings. I think this is a very sensible roadmap for a project that hasn't launched yet. Now, this is something you don't see every day, and that is a link to an audit direct from the pre-sale website. Play Doge audit security assessment from the 22nd of May 2024, very recently, only two weeks ago. Now, I'm not going to go into too much depth on the audit, but this has replaced the DEX tools section of the video that we normally do where we review the token. In this, I'm going to show you two things the contract ownership and the mintability of tokens. As you can see here, the ownership is renounced. The ownership of the token is renounced, hence the owner cannot change any settings in the contract. This is a green flag. The second green flag is the minting of tokens. The contract owner cannot mint new tokens. The owner cannot mint new tokens once the contract is deployed. We've seen there are 9.4 billion tokens. There will be no more. And for those of you wanting to do your own research, I will leave all of the links to Play Doge and this audit and all of their socials in the description below. So please make sure to check them out. Another really nice feature of Play Doge is the ability to stake your tokens. There are 159 million tokens already staked on the platform. 
with estimated rewards of 118%. This is the place to stake and the staking rewards are connected to the Binance Smart Chain block. So every block, there will be 17.88 tokens released. They have mapped out until April 2027, the total supply. As you can see, it doesn't move a great deal. The roadmap, the tokenomics, and the game itself all check out. Let's have a quick look at what has been said about Play Doge in the media. This morning then, Crypto Potato put an article up, Play Doge pre-sale surges past $2.5 million in just 10 days. Could this meme coin explode? One thing I would say about this token is it's certainly not a meme coin. It's associated with a bona fide game. The project is Play Doge. The token is called Play. It's taken the market by storm and raised $2.5 million in the first 10 days. With hundreds of thousands pouring into the pre-sale daily, some analysts believe this brand new meme coin could explode once it hits exchanges. The token is listed at just under half a cent right now. That's the price that you will be able to buy it from on their website. I'm going to show you how to do that later on in the video. And I'm also going to give you my price prediction for this token at the very end in my conclusion. But you can see it is well covered in the media and this is another green flag for me. Heading over to social media then, Play Doge has both a Telegram group and an X account. They have just over 2,000 followers on X. Again, this is a relatively new account, only started in May 2024. Over time, I would expect this to grow into the tens of thousands. And most of their tweets revolve around the pre-sale at this moment in time. Introducing Play Doge, the only P2E Doge companion. Inspired by the legacy of Tamagotchi, feed, train and play with your 2D Doge to earn play. Don't neglect your Doge, his life's on the line. Join the pre-sale now. So there's a lot to go through. What I would recommend, follow the link in the description below, go over to their account and give them a follow on Twitter. That's the least you can do to stay in touch with the project. So to buy the Play token, you have three options. You can buy with BNB, USDT or with your card. You simply connect your wallet and choose the wallet that you want to use. Personally, I prefer MetaMask. So buying the token could not be easier. So what do I think then of Play Doge? Well, first of all, I like the game. I am old enough to remember the original Tamagotchi. I'm old enough to remember the Commodore 16 and the Commodore 64. So this pulls at my heartstrings. I did indeed have my own Tamagotchi back in the day as well. I think for gamers, especially gamers of a new generation that aren't used to 8-bit games, this will appeal to them more than some of the more modern games. It's simpler, it's easier to play, it's easier to pick up and put down, and it has a little bit of excitement to your day by making sure that your Doge gets fed and looked after. As far as the token is concerned, where would I see the price going? Normally with a pre-sale, you would expect to get the token at a tenth of the price. The token is currently 0.005 or half of a cent. I would expect this token to go to somewhere near 5 cents at its peak. So you're looking at getting a good return on this token. And of course, the more people that play the game, the more scarce the token becomes and you will have to buy these tokens. I think having the staking available is a very nice trick. We've talked before on the channel about having staking available on other games. The reason being, it drains the supply on exchanges, it drains the supply on DeFi, and it stops the token from flooding the market. So having staking available and offering such a good APR will keep the price high. Remember, having these tokens allows you to play the game, it allows you to feed your animal, and you will earn more play as you go along. When you look at games that people get into at the very beginning, they are the people that make the biggest returns. When this token is at two, three, four cents, the profit will be gone. Getting it in at less than half a cent is where the action is at. But as always, you have to remember to buy these tokens responsibly. I'm not gonna come on here and tell you to degen all of your Bitcoin into Play Doge. I'm coming on here to treat this as a pre-sale and allocate a certain amount of your assets to this game. Remember, it is not live yet. That is why the price is so cheap. You are getting in really early on. 
And this is the time that you can make big returns on your investment if you get into projects in pre-sale. We've checked everything out that we can. The website is fine, the audit is fine. The proof is when the game goes live, but this already looks polished and I can't foresee any issues with recreating Tamagotchi as Play Doge in the future. And once this hits centralized exchanges, then the price is likely to really, really ramp up. So in conclusion then, go and check out all the links, go and see what you think of Play Doge. So we are more than likely to dip our toe into Play Doge and we will certainly be playing the game. And to play the game, you need the tokens. We'll probably buy them and stake them over the next few days. So make sure to go and check them out. I hope you like this review. And if you have, make sure to subscribe to Crypto Warehouse and help make more videos like this. All of the links to Play Doge will be down below, so go and check them out. You, as always, have been great. I have been Mike. Until the next video, goodbye.